about some robots. Hey, about to learn about some robots. Hey! Hello family, Calvin Nellum coming through with the first Vex EDR video. You know, I, I know I haven't really showed you all, you know, the robotic side of me and I feel like this is a perfect time for us to learn about the basic parts of a robot. There are four basic parts of a robot. The first one, you got the control system. The control system is the brain of the robot, okay? So if you pretty much are talking about the logic, the decision making, the, the reasoning that the, that the robot may have the capabilities of doing, that's always gonna be in the control system, that is the brain. Second part, you have the drivetrain. So the drivetrain, right, is drivetrain. You're driving, is the mobile, is how you're moving, okay? So generally if you have a cyborg, right, that is a human robot, those have legs, that's their drivetrain. That's considered a drivetrain because that's how they move. Or if you have a rover robot that may have wheels or some type of tank tracks, that is also considered a drivetrain. Three, manipulators, right? So manipulators is how it interacts with the environment. Many robots has to have some type of manipulator to interact with the environment, whether that's an arm, whether that's a sucking suction, something that is interacting with the environment, it needs that. Four, body frame, right? The body, you gotta have a body, right? And the body is the structure, right? That is the torso of the robot. What is inside of it, okay? Um, the electrical structures are generally in the body as well, but you need that control system. That's the main part. Thank you all so much for tuning in to four basic parts of the robot. Check out my link, subscribe to my channel. I have some more stuff coming through. We're about to dig deep into this thing all day. Let's get it. Wow, this draft.